This is going to be possibly a really big day. I'm actually on my way to a Dodge dealership with the little bro, Matthias, and we are possibly going to be picking up a Hellcat today. And this is something I've been toying with the idea for a long time, just never really done it. How long have I talked about wanting a Challenger but never doing it? For like two years. For like two years, I've wanted one. I'm like, I'm not gonna do it, I'm not gonna do it, I'm not gonna do it. But we have a new brand we're launching. He's actually gonna be heading up store development, social media, all the like the back end business running of that company. He's gonna be getting trained up on that stuff. But we're actually going to be doing a car suite stakes as well now but there's going to be a lot of information that's going to be really soon new brand new website all new stuff not taking over the LP stuff i'm still doing that every month just like i have been it's just going to be a new thing that's mostly going to be on a whole separate platform other than just like if i have something really cool i want to do with the car on the channel that's one thing but for the most part the car giveaway stuff is going to be on the car social media platforms and all that stuff a totally separate ordeal we're on our way we're looking at the car we were going to look at a black one but the car ended up not being quite what we wanted and the dealership was very upfront though when I made my appointment the manager said that he went out there looked at the car and then he called me back he said hey I just want to let you know if it were me this isn't a fifty thousand dollar car to me he's like the car's got some dings on the body that I wouldn't you know look at as acceptable some flaws some scratches he's like I'm not gonna tell you to come out here thinking I can persuade you into buying a car that I don't think is worth the price he's like and I don't think I can help you get any better you know pricing on it so he's like no Knowing what you do for social media and everything else, he's like, I don't want to steer you in the wrong direction. I would recommend finding another one. I really appreciated that because it's not every day a dealership tries to talk you out of coming to buy their car, especially a fifty thousand dollar car. But they were actually they did. They were being very honest, and we bought a couple of newer trucks from them, and we're gonna continue to buy stuff from them just for that reason. You know, honesty goes a long way with me. We're gonna go look at this car. It's it's pretty nasty. What do you think about it? I think it's sweet. It's it's pretty nasty. I mean, it's pretty sick in the pictures. What's funny is I'll just save it for when we go see the car. Dang, they got some cars out here. There it is right there. Look, it's got my name in it. Malachi Feeman right in the window. <laughs> How crazy is that, bro? <laughs> oh, man. Well, you guys saw it, so we're going to swing in there, take this thing for a whip. We might be leaving with this car today. What did we just do, bro? Got what a, just happened? Got a brand new car. Got a brand new freaking I would say brand new it's actually not brand new it's new to me but it has a whopping 7,000 miles on it so I guess technically it's not new we just freaking snagged that Hellcat I was gonna do a, a loan on it but they wouldn't take a loan because they didn't want to like wire the loan and stuff like that because it was gonna take some time and then I'd have to leave and they wouldn't actually have the money until like tomorrow or something and they're like yeah no we're not gonna do that I'm like Okay, so I did a cash wire transfer, so I paid cash for the car. I'm gonna give it away, so instead of paying off the car at the end of the giveaway, when I give it away, it's just already paid off, so it doesn't matter. Either way, the car had to be paid for, so I just figured whatever. We'll pay cash today instead of in a few weeks. We're starving, and it's like 2 o'clock, and I didn't eat breakfast. He probably didn't eat breakfast. So we're gonna eat, because we gotta go in one vehicle anyways, because I'm gonna grab him some lunch since he drove me all the way out here, and then get back inside, and hopefully they got the wire transfer, and we're all good to go. This car's crazy. We're in the car. Now, this is a... Thing that I'm kind of confused about. There's three keys in the car right now. Two red keys and a black key. Which key is it going to start off of? I've never tried this yet. First time starting it with all three in the car. Red key. Okay. Wow. Got it. So I guess it just chooses a more powerful key um, if you have them all in the vehicle. There's my brother. <laughs> this thing's actually empty, bro. I gotta fill it up. Right. Yeah. Which gas can you go to? Is there one down there? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna punch in my phone and then I'll just go. But you can just follow me. Hello. Nice, yeah. Sweet. Just gonna get on down the road and get this thing filled up. Guys, this feels so unreal right now. Like, oh my gosh. Can you see me smiling? Can you see me smiling right now? Got the cruise set right now, foot's off the throttle. You know, don't wanna have any craziness happen, but like, this is my first time owning ever a high performance vehicle. That's a car, not a truck. And like, it's just crazy to me. This is just nuts. My eyes are completely open to a whole different love for the automotive world. I mean, this is just absolutely mind-blowing how fun this thing is to drive. I mean, it's scary. So if you're an irresponsible person, you got three troopers on, four troopers on one guy. 
But if you're an irresponsible person, you should never buy this vehicle unless you have the money to cover up those irresponsible behaviors. I never really was a speed type of guy, but when you get in a car like this, it makes you become one. Oh my gosh. We got the car back and here it is. That was a full reveal of the vehicle itself. I do want to show you some of the basic stuff that I'm impressed with that I like about the car and just some basic features. And then after that, we're gonna go probably on a drive with my brother, maybe my wife. <laughs> he got lost? Yeah. Well, hi. You missed the exit. Bro, what do you think? Sweet. <laughs> I was behind you on the highway. I was getting close to you. I was like, what is this dude doing? And all of a sudden you like took off like, 85, I was like, okay. Yeah, this thing's freaking so fast. Oh my gosh. I'm not a car guy at heart, just so everybody is very clear. I'm somebody that like, I've always been interested in trucks and I always thought the idea of a car would be so cool, but I wanted to wait till the timing was right and I think this is the perfect timing. And if you haven't heard, this car is actually being used for the launch of our new company and I will reveal the name, the brand, the website, all that stuff very soon. But let's just say you want to stay tuned and go follow LNP underscore speed on Instagram. That's the account that this is going to be given away on. If you want to get entered to win this thing, follow the account and you'll be the first to know. So let's show you around the car and the basic stuff. You have, we didn't even really look around it that much. We drove it and then that was it. We didn't pop the hood. We didn't look around. The, I mean, just, I was like, well, it's freaking clean. It runs great. It smells new under the hood. You, ever, you smell that? It smells like fresh, like engine being broken. Like even though it's got 7,000 miles on it, it just smells like new rubber and plastics. But. So you, of course you've got your SRT badge on the engine. It's a supercharged 6.2 liter, all that good stuff. You've got the intake right here on each side where the uh, ordinarily your other headlight bulb would be if you got like a V6 model. Can't remember if the 392s had the intakes there or not. Can't remember, all I know is for sure on the V6 models, those are just a normal light, they're not an intake. Of course you've got your vents here and stuff, it's an actually active hood for airflow and stuff like that and cooling, which is actually sick. I like the matte hood, there were some people that are like, you know, don't get a matte hood, and there are people that were like, get a car with the matte hood. I just fell in love with this one. And the other thing is too, here's what's funny, is I was making posts on my Instagram of a white Challenger with a black hood, and did I already buy the car by that time, or was I totally just using a random picture? That was just a random picture. Yeah, totally just a random picture. Had nothing to do with this car. I just thought, oh, this is so sick. And then this car popped up for sale, and I was like, I gotta have it. It's more than I wanted to spend on one of them, but it's a car that I really wanted, which makes it all worthwhile. Not to mention, even though I'm not keeping it very long, I think a lot of people are gonna like the white with the matte black hood more than just like a straight up black car or something along the lines of that. I feel like it just has it just has more contrast, more uniqueness about it. And then when you go to the interior, of course, you've got this huge cabin, lots of room, and that's why I feel like it fits me better in terms of a muscle car. Like for me, I'm not I'm not a real big guy, I'm just under six foot, but for me personally, I like to have more room around me. I'm not the type of guy that likes to get in the real small tight stuff that's just not a lot of fun for me now of course you don't have a back seat but you know it is what it is everything's just cool everything's real clean real fresh nothing's ripped up seats not wore down i mean it's awesome everything's very nicely maintained and kept up i mean it's sweet it does need some tint on it though i will say that it does need some tint let's see how that goes Do you want to go for a drive? And yes, I know you're supposed to take those off. They just had those put on at the dealership when I left. I don't know why, they just did. And another note, guys, this truck is up for grabs right now. So if you want to get entered to win this truck, every $5 is five entries towards winning this truck, plus $5,000 cash. And this giveaway ends on June 4th, which is not much time. That's less than three weeks away. Then this giveaway is gone. So if you want to enter to win this truck, plus $5,000 cash, go down to lmpgear.com. Link is in the description below. Every $5 you spend on any of the gear gets you five entries towards winning this truck. Oh, Reagan, watch. Oh my gosh. 
Cadillac stopped her. I do like certain safety features about some cars, like that Cadillac has auto stop. If you're like backing up onto a blind road and it sees the vehicle coming on, like just now, I was like, oh Lord, please stop, 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 stop. Well, the car stopped her. So I like that kind of stuff. Stopped her before she got in the road. Now you have to like kind of roll into it. So you can't do like a full blown like pedal down zero to 60 cause it's not gonna grip. It's not gonna grab the ground with the stock tires on it. Oh That's crazy, dude. Oh my goodness. That thing wanted to spin so bad. And yeah, when we took off, you could feel it lifting and I started know, spinning. I know. I had to let out of the throttle like two or three times yeah, a little we bit. Yeah, had to restart like three times. Yeah, that's crazy. Let's just do a roll. Like, let's start from like 20. You ready? 20 to 60 roll. Let's do it. That's just not right. That's just crazy. This is gonna sound like the dumbest thing ever, but it like sinks your eyes further back into your head when you accelerate all the way down. <laughs> Dude, it's, it's crazy. Oh man, it's nuts. I gotta go for a ride here with the wife and when we get back, she's gonna love this. Now we only drive the speed limit everywhere we go. Right, Thais? Amen. Do you like the color? What's the guy from Fast Furious? Fast Furious. and Furious. Which guy? Vin Diesel. Oh, Vin Diesel. <laughs> that's what Doesn't it makes you. Have one? That's what it makes you think of. Yeah. What's his name? Paul. The guy that passed away. Paul Walker. Paul Walker. You ready? Come over here. Mm. Which key are you using? Cadillac sound like that. <laughs> Actually, the Cadillac does have a 6.2 liter uh, V8 in it. It actually probably sound pretty good. Why do we have all white vehicles in this right now? I don't right know. Now? Well, we do have three white vehicles right here. Open the door. Sit, look inside of this thing. is mostly going to be her holding it facing herself in acceleration 0 to 60 in her facial expression. A freaking... Okay. If I small uh, this, imagine a demon. Oh man. I would probably kill myself in a demon though. No, like you, you can kill yourself in this if you're not careful. No, I'm saying like you can in any car honestly. I'm gonna do it a roller from like 15 because otherwise. <laughs> We're doing all this a back road. You should probably be clear with people. On oh that. yeah, Sh show them the view really quick. I'll yeah, stop. Show them the view. Just so everybody's very fields. aware. Nothing to hit absolutely anywhere in terms of people, other vehicles. There's nothing behind us yeah. for a mile. There's nothing in front of us. We want to do that. Okay. okay. Ready? Yep. I'm ready. Holy crap! <laughs> it keeps slipping. <laughs> it kept slipping. It's not even wet out. No, it's, it's not. It's rear-end. It's going so fast, it can't even freaking grip. I know. It's because it's just the tires. Like, I was even talking to Tyler about this because he just picked up a Hellcat. My brother-in-law just picked up a Hellcat, too. It's like, these tires, like, they're fine, but when it comes to, like, actually accelerating hard, you have to roll into it. He's like, otherwise, you will not get traction. Yeah, they probably don't Wet or really. dry pavement, doesn't matter. They just do it. So you can take off. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> I feel like I'm in, with Tyler right now because he used to do that crap all the time to me. Or my uncle, oh my gosh, my uncle has two oh, Corvettes and he does this crap all the way home to Texas. Okay, yeah, just don't lose your end. <laughs> oh shoot, I don't like that. I don't like how the rear end cannot grip. Ready, ready, ready? You ready? Yeah, just don't lose your end. Oh shoot, there you go. It's got grip. Oh, Power delivery is so smooth. It's like yeah. a ton, but it's just so smooth. We should do a video next with a 500 horse key and let you drop, start on that first. Start. You're only going 70. <laughs> okay. Easy. We got the cops called on us. There ain't no cops out here. So what do you think about that? <laughs> 
was fun. Yeah, we're gonna give this thing away. That's crazy. Oh my goodness. I've never owned one of these or driven one of these. I can't That's even nuts. You bought it. I don't think it's processed yet. No, like it, it's just crazy. We always talk about it. It looks like there's a lot of vehicles around here, but they come and go so quick. Yeah. The only thing that's staying right now is Rosine Cadillac, so. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Enjoy the last little clip of this car rolling past. Remember, go to LNP Speed on Instagram. Follow that account once it hits 10K. We're launching the giveaway for this vehicle. And I know most of you guys do not want to miss out on that. Thank you guys so much. Don't forget to enter to win that truck. And this video is going up on Friday. How many days left do you have in your giveaway? If it oh, has wow. a Friday. What's what? today, Tuesday? It ends the 19th. Um, Today's the- Four days left. You have four days left? Four days left. Go to her website, dieselbabegear.com. It'll say my wife's giveaway website and my wife's truck giveaway website down in the description below and enter to win her black second gen 12 Elf. It's a short bed extended cab. Every $5 is 10 entries to win right now and that giveaway is ending in four days. Get entered, you've got time to enter the white giveaway. It ends in about three weeks, but hers is ending in four days. If you wanna get entered to win that truck, last chance and then it is gone. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Follow that Instagram account, get entered to win the trucks. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Enjoy the clip. Peace.